today's adventure, Kenzie and I are in the process of selling some land. Yes, you heard me, land. Land is extremely valuable because it ain't going nowhere. <laughs> I'm going to sell two lots. This lot, this lot that I'm on the way to now is a 30 by 130 lot, um, which is point. 09 acres if you want that in acreages it is zoned for two family of course anything zoned for two family you'd have to get a variance to go turn it into a three family so i'm gonna go check it out i'm listing it actually so i'm gonna go get some pictures of it let's go get there so i can show you the lay of the land lay of the land guys so me and my trusted sidekick we're out here princess at the of r and b so Obviously, somebody needs a haircut. <laughs> somebody needs a haircut. This is the lot. Kenzie, it's a 30 by 100 lot. You can see that goes back pretty deep. Um, This actually looks like a, a bigger lot, but as you can see, um, these are typically the style houses that go up on these lots. It is zoned for two family. That is also a two family. I told you. Somebody's extremely talkative. I told you guys that if you wanted to put a three family on this, you'd have to you'd have to apply to the city of East Orange and get a variance to um, have this officially mandated okay to turn into a three family. Now, let me just show you the street. This is called Dodtown East Orange. It's a section of East Orange. It's near the Montclair. If you go that way, that's going to a Montclair. That's also going to a Montclair, but this is also Bloomfield. So it's a, um, it's not technically a redevelopment zone yeah. because it's so close, really um, high income areas. Um, so it's not redevelopment, but it's not redevelopment but again it's a great opportunity the homes over here new constructions are going for well over five hundred thousand um easily one hundred fifty thousand in profit if not more so it's a great lot we got to get the lot mowed so we can get a sign up here uh, but yeah let's do it we're going to list it for 115 and keep it pushing Three days later. Updates on Sanford Avenue. Let's go check them out. Shall we? Come on. Stairs are less. That's where you started at? You didn't start? Oh, look, paint on the wall. See? That's what I'm saying. See? See? See, see what she looked for on the roof? Yeah. That's what you're supposed to come. You look oh, no, oh, you like painted this part. Look, you want to go to the third floor first and work yeah. my way down? Third floor, I just got to clean. Right okay. 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 Cause I hate to go. From what you video yes, time, sir. Right? That's good. Always. Memory on point. Don't forget these filters, my my dear. Yeah, I got you. My sunshine. That's part of the finishing touches. And cleaning detail. You know what I'm saying? That thing you went so we still got to do the bordering on the floor. The main thing, like we said, you know what we said, right? Yeah. The main thing is yeah. the painting. Everything's agreed on with the painting. Now everything's agreed on with the floor. Now I can do the finish. You just got to do a little touch up. See, see that saying? little spot there? See, exactly. You see how you see how I am, right? No, 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 no that's what I'm saying. Just a little bit of touch up, nothing crazy, but a little bit of touch up for sure. So see, look and see how we how we just coming in and out of here. See, you got you got the spot. That's just like you come in, you put the blue tape marks. You understand what I'm saying? You seeing what I'm saying? Now, I'm here every day doing this. So no, I know you're doing the main stuff first. I got that. Trust me, I got it. See how I see how you replace these two filters. I appreciate that. Thank you. And see, this floor looks good. This floor, we're almost done. Just a little bit more. A little bit more on the floor, but we good. 
Just a little bit of touch. Let me just take a peek in his bathroom. All right, little stuff in the bathroom. You know the caulking of the sink and the tub, yada, yada, yada. Nothing crazy. You know, the small stuff is always It's all, that, I know. Not being the biggest. It's life. What do you want me to tell you, Fred? Sure. But we almost there. We're getting there. That's there is progress. That's all I need. And now I'm just praying. Yeah, between the two cabinets at the bottom. How do you see that? Yeah, how do you call that? You got to put something there. Oh, yeah, right there. Remember, we didn't move the cabinets. No, see, you here, didn't. And I noticed this, but now we got to get a, 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 what you call it, from here. Right, because this isn't mm -hmm. right, Minaj. This isn't a, the face. You don't have a face for the cabinet. So maybe we can get a, a piece. I just a face for you. this, yeah. See? And then we got a point, yeah. We're gonna get that. Everybody go to the cabinet place. The guy, Take uh, a picture. Kenny. Yeah. No, no. The guy on the roof. What are we putting here? What's his name? The roof here? And South Orange? We're not there no more. We're right here on South Orange Avenue. Craig, are you moving this? Yeah, we're gonna get a new sink. Okay, yeah, because that looks crazy. Faucet. Yeah, okay, that looks crazy. Thank you. You know, replace the sink? Or Have to. Faucet, faucet. Faucet. This will be clean. It's clean. It's gonna be clean. Okay. Oh, All right. Okay. Dirty. Yeah, I know. All right, so but the main stuff so is done. So the guy on South Orange Avenue and Roofdale Corner? No, he's not there no more. He's crossed street from the gas station. You go down the side. Yeah, yeah. You go, as soon as you get down the side, yeah, yeah, he's right there. Yeah, right there. Across the gas station, the yeah. right the 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 yeah. All right, so you already know. I don't need to tell you what I want, right? Exactly. Right? I don't need to tell you. Exactly. <laughs> Craig, Craig, look, I don't really need to tell you, dude. No. I know. Exactly. And that's what I love about you, that I don't really need to tell you. No, you already right. know what I'm going to say. That's right. You already know how I'm going to say it. You I mean, Minaj, you this is finishing work. Yeah. All of this is finishes. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, the finishes are what makes the deal. The main work is done. We need the finishes to look like this. Because... Let me explain. The finishes is going to make the difference between ten and forty thousand dollars. You need to understand that. That is going to set us apart. The finishes. So that's what I'm going to come down most on you guys and be more critical on you guys or how we finish this. This is just basics. But when it comes down to the glamour, I need this place to be shiny. Like I want to come in here and be blinded by the wall. You get what I mean? Because that's the difference between ten and forty thousand dollars. Why is this here? It was there. Just I'll take it off. Yeah. It ain't even hooked up. That's not a, a, a outlet. It shouldn't even. Or, it I'm was. gonna I'm gonna ignore that because I know that's not a real outlet. And you know I would have said something anyway. Exactly. Right. You Craig knows me. He knows I would say something. My main thing was getting this place painted, and then we move on to finishes. I did want to talk to you guys about the outside porch and what we're doing with that. I mean, this is, don't correct. I mean, we have a way to handle that stuff up there, right? That's just cleaning? Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's just cleaning. Yeah, exactly. oh, Okay, and that we're going to forget these filters. Oh, God, the filters are... Oh, so this is going to be... Oh, we're doing this out here. Oh, because it's waterproof. That should be decent. And then we could just clean it up, right? Yeah. All right, but who's going to do, like, this little... Besides power washing, just, like, pushing it up... You see what I mean? Like, look, Craig, like. Listen. Sean is not doing it now. Minaj, power washing is one thing, but we need this stuff cleaned, like, okay. Once we clean it. Right. You think who can clean this? The power washing said. You will do even inside the house because everything you do here is going to fall down here. It's okay. Oh, you have to ho put a hole here. Yeah. Right? Well, I have to make a train. Yeah, he gonna have to because this otherwise we yeah. talking crazy. No, no, no type of water, anything. What did you tell me about the basement windows? Uh, no, he, 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 they were not the right size, but he's doing it to okay. frame them out. Okay, okay, which is more of a headache. <laughs> you know, you do realize that, right? Yeah. Framing them out is more of a headache than getting the right size. Well, you understand I've experienced because when you frame it out, now you gotta go around and do the whole doggone. You understand? <laughs> you understand. No, you, this can be painted. This will be painted white, right? This will be painted white. Uh, whatever, whatever the cleaning don't do. You know, it's seventy-five dollars per window once you frame it out to do the actual side, the aluminum siding around the windows. Mm -hmm. 
It's actually easier to get the right size. I really wish we could have got the right yeah, sizes. Any, uh, uh, I tell you, I've, more in my experience, the right sizes is better. I'm gonna keep it real with you. Oh God, that's such a grill outside the window. No, 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 no. Finishes always take the most time, unfortunately. It's the most important. It can make the difference in your money between, as I was telling him, between ten to $40,000 if the finishes are done right. So we gotta get this right. I was a problem, they didn't care till I made it.